Hello everyone! Welcome back to episode 10 of We Happy Few! The first two-digit episode! Woo! So, we left off on Joy and in the cozy cottage. And what I realized while swapping our inventory... Um, this song that's playing now, this is like the happier version and probably the original version of the one that's playing in in the house where we had to solve the riddles to get to go to the safe house. Although, I mean, probably that's the 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 version that you hear when you're off joy, so But really but the music is um the same, it just um, a little bit catchier and more upbeat. So, but I'm still gonna loot this because no one's watching. And now we're leaving because I didn't want to take a nap here. I was a little bit worried. Yeah, I was worried that maybe our joy would wear off and then the constable and then we wouldn't be able to get out. So this is where we stayed. This is really nice. This, this looks so nice. This looks so fun and I really hope that... Um, I really hope that the, that the whole city that we're getting into now will be the same. May okay. I express my delight that you passed the examination, sir? We've not had as many as we'd hoped, sir. Not as many at all. And yet, they say the unexamined life is not worth living. Well, sir, welcome back. Oh, and in case your rustication has been of long duration, please bear in mind there is now a nocturnal curfew. Best be indoors after nightfall, sir. Okay, so that's also good to know that there is a night curfew where we shouldn't be seen. <sighs> this is so nice. <laughs> this is so nice in a strange way. Okay, but now let's get out of here. <laughs> okay, loading screen again. Now entering Maiden Hall. Okay. Uh huh. Isn't this wonderful? Oh, I can't remember the last time someone came through. <gasps> Welcome back to civilization. This is so awkward. And so from here, I've got to get to St. George's home and then into the parade. Except that I need a letter of transit to get into the parade. Like the one I left on my desk in the parade. How do I get a new one? Wait, the old government printing office was on Maiden Home. Maybe I can break in and steal some blanks. Oh, wow. <sighs> I'm really excited now for what will happen if our joy wears off, how this really looks off our joy, because this is kind of... This is overwhelming. This looks so nice. I finally have a lot of material to do on my... to put on my thumbnails. <laughs> okay, so this is another mood booth. It's so awesome! I love it! I'm really... although, yeah, I'm really excited to see how it looks without Joy. And our Joy is draining really fast. I wonder if it didn't drain back in there because it, we sh wouldn't have been able to go out the other way. So maybe it, should have, it could have been possible that we don't. We could have slept there and nothing would have happened. So we're on our Joy and we're pretty safe now. I guess no one would look at us funny or anything. So, but we also shouldn't rummage around through the trash again. I'm just gonna take a quick look at the map. Okay, so we have to go all the way to here. And what's this? Find the hatch on Maidenholm. Oh, this is a safe house. That's a good thing. Okay. So, I think we're gonna do this first again, 
break into the old government printing office. It's a really big task. But I think this episode we're going to spend on, yeah, looking around the area a bit and also, no, wrong button again. Also find, no wait, I don't need to use a waypoint. I'm just gonna follow the quests. Yes. Okay, so this is our main quest now. Also, yeah, it's about time that we get inside because it's getting it's in the evening already. This looks so fun. I just really hope that nothing I just really hope that we don't that we don't have to take a joy whenever it's, Odd. it's wearing off. Why are there papers patrolling the park? I should snoop around a bit. Oh, what's here? Papers. Police. Oh, okay, it's a downer detector, but I'm not a downer. I should be able to pass. Oh no, I'm just passing. No, no, no. Sorry, sorry. Okay, I definitely shouldn't do this. On the other hand, I want to, but it's... N no. Maybe this is not the right thing to do during the husband, day. I just need a little more joy in his life. He seems to be trying to soak it in through his skin. And, um... So what I was saying, I'm really um, a little bit scared to see if we can, how well we will be able to blend in if we don't have joy in us. Oh, okay, this is the constabulary. Okay. Because we'll be off it really soon. And as far as I saw, there's, there's, there's some monitors around. Floating around and maybe they will be able to detect joy too? Or not? Oh, okay, it's wearing off. Oh. It's been a while, hasn't it? People sure will notice and become right? upset. You attack more slowly and do less damage. Crafting and other tasks take longer. That's the one. Oh done no. It. Right. No that cuts right. it. Okay, no that's really Mr. bad. <laughs> okay. I did not expect it to be this bad that everyone would become would come running after us. So I don't know. I just wanna escape for now. Oh wow. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh god. Oh great. No, I'm in the trap. I did nothing. Okay. Do they see me up here? Right. Oh no. Oh no! Oh god, oh god, oh god. Vengeance is So when will they stop? Police again. Oh god. No 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 no, I don't want to do this. See me. They will see me. No, 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 no. The killer's right there. Okay, I'm definitely not getting this. Why is everyone so upset with me now? I can't keep doing this. There's the one that did it. Okay, I'm just gonna leave now. Are they not able to pass here? Oh, 
Okay. This is definitely not how I wanted this to end. I just thought that we would get off our joy and... I don't know. I was kind of hoping that we so don't have to be on drugs all the time to not... Oh, he's the only one left. Well then, hello there, buddy. It's not personal. Okay. Okay, so... What I'm not getting right now is, are we on Joy now? Because we didn't take any. Um, okay, 0% Joy. <sighs> okay, so... I should also put away my weapon, I should also stop crouching, and I should also heal up. So, not crouching, put away my weapon, and... Heal up. So, okay. Oh. I won't be. So, there they are. I won't be sus. If I go past these guys, I won't be suspicious, right? Yeah, they should definitely see me like this. Okay. Who? Okay, I didn't. I didn't imagine it to be this bad, because I don't know how sick can we look that everyone starts to be so weirded out. And why was someone suspicious here? Because I jumped? Okay. No, I'm just gonna walk around here like a normal person would do. Hello there, old lady. Um, well, that was certainly something. Because, yeah, I didn't imagine it to be this bad when you come off joy that everyone would always, would just, I don't know, start to run wild and try to kill you. Because, I don't know, I didn't do anything. What's happening here? Okay, I definitely need some some new tactic or something. Okay, so this is where I oh flowers. This is where I hit. This is where I was hiding out before too. I'm not gonna take another joy. Right now we're. You're jumping around, lady. You're weird, acting weird. Oh, this is the hatch. This is the hatch. And this isn't suspicious, but okay. I won't. I won't ask questions. Poor guys. I suppose there are more lingering ways to go. Mm hmm. Okay. So we need to turn off the power, I guess. No, just the other quest. Did this just become non-active or I'm again wrong? So yeah, this one. Okay. I still want to pursue this quest though. Okay, so the generator's back there. How do I get there? If I jump across this on a table, does this work? Let's find out. Oops. Yes, it does work. Very good. How do I know? Is this wrong or not? Ooh! No. Hmm. So there's no way here. No. No! Oh! Ouch! Ouch! I'm sorry. Well, that was easier. <laughs> <laughs> that was easier than I was afraid it would be. Welcome to today's edition of Humor Hour, the show where you tell me jokes. Well, actually, I tell the jokes and you send them in. And the first joke comes from Winston's 
Okay, but... Oh no! See what Winston has to tell us. Dear Uncle Jack, I love your show, especially humor hour. Blah, 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 blah. And here's one of you that always cracks us up. Question. How can you tell a German from a pickle? Answer. You can't. You can't tell a German anything. <laughs> Very good, Winston Smith. Thank you for that. Winston Smith? Wasn't the, the protagonist in, in, uh, in Orwell of 1984? It was also Winston Smith. It's a nice Easter egg. Because the stories are really, are very much alike. Okay. Um. <laughs> Maybe I'm stuck here now. Also, I'm almost dying from shock. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. How do I get over there? Okay, I'm definitely gonna do. I'm definitely gonna need another healing bomb. I'm sorry. Okay, is there any clue here? Maybe there's a way to turn off the power so the water isn't quite so lethal. Yeah, so I guess it's over there, but how do I get there? Because I shouldn't. Because it doesn't look like I can go in there. And. When I touch the water, I can't really move. So. What do you call an angry German? That's a. A sauerkraut. Huh. Sauerkraut. Hmm. Is there anything here? Station closed during beautification. Hmm. Because there aren't any buttons that we could press here. No, there's not. I'm a little bit at a loss here because I don't know what to do. This doesn't do anything and I don't know what else I could throw. Except for a dart, but I guess this is doesn't help a lot either. Oh, and also I left the dart behind. If I jump into this, this will be... I don't know what's on the other side, because, but whatever. If we die, it doesn't matter. Oh no, oh no, okay. Still a bit sloshy. Good place for giant octopi. I'm pretty sure that this shouldn't, this, this wasn't the way it was supposed to go. This felt a bit like cheating, but I really didn't see another way. <laughs> Blueprint for jerky. And formula for black powder. And what do we have here? It's a blueprint for mother's little helper. I think that we have a lot of new stuff to craft. And what's this? A damp diary. We're gonna read this. Monday. Made it this far. The hardest part was continuing to go to work without joy, seeing how daft they all are, but pretending, pretending, pretending to be like them while I made my plans. Oh yes, I'm a great pretender. She was always so sure there was a resistance plotting away. Why can't I find them? The, the celebrated Mr. K says there isn't any such thing. But she was so sure. Is he lying? Doesn't he trust me? I suppose there's no reason for him to do. Will he help? Tuesday. Does she miss me? She's always stiff upper lip, but every now and then one detects a twinge of feeling behind the mask. She'd say, Would you like to have would you like some tea, love? And I could swear she meant more. That's what I meant when I said it to her. She never called anyone else love. And sometimes her hand would linger for just a moment when I handed her the cup. I miss her. I don't miss the rest of the lot. Certainly not that awful Arthur, always making googly eyes at me. Wednesday. Mr. Kite says to lay low a bit longer. If I turn off the pump, the water will build up. Then if there's an intruder, I can just turn the power on. Thursday. Oh god, I dreamed V and I were swimming. We swam and swam until we turned around and couldn't see Wellington Wells anymore. And then we dove for a million fathoms. But then I lost her in the darkness. Friday. Nervous wreck. Two bobbies chased me, coming back from the phone booth. Thank god I rigged the electricity. They made the most awful sound. I wonder if they had sweethearts. Are some girls missing them right now the way... 
or someone just popping an extra joy and trying to forget why. Saturday, more dreams of V. Even after I woke, I stayed in bed with my eyes closed so I wouldn't lose the feeling she was with me. I could still go to a mood booth and pretend nothing happened, but I won't. I won't do it. Not even if she meant the way she looked at me. She'd never stray from her appointed path, no matter how much she loved anyone. I suppose she mustn't. She's not really English, is she? I wonder if she's really the daughter of a Maharaja. She mustn't let anyone remember her skin is dark and her hair is dark and her eyes. Mustn't think about that. But she stands there like a statue. Sometimes, and she seems like someone out of Bhagavad Gita, if you take away the jyot purse and the riding suit and put her in robes of silk. Mustn't think about that. Now is the time to dare and endure, says the old man. Sunday. Nauseated. Cooked Bobby was bad enough, but now it's rotting Bobby. I need a new shelter pronto. Must find out if Kay thinks it's safe to move. Time to leave another message. Was this... Was this another Diary of Prudence? I think this was Diary of Prudence, but I guess she didn't like Arthur a lot. Maybe Arthur was interested in Prudence, but Prudence was interested in V? This is another of my theories, so maybe it's awfully wrong again, but then we probably will find out really soon. So let's go to the workbench. So what's there to craft? The mother's little helper. For softer punishment, be nice yet firm. Slow but durable deals moderate non-lethal damage. What do we need for this? Linen, a rolling pin, a cloth scrap, and a sewing kit. Okay. In okay, case so it is like a melee weapon. A head knocker, we already have that. Rick the stunt duck. I saw this before and I didn't mm, read what it was. This is an odd duck indeed, so odd that everyone will tend to pay attention to it for a few previous moments, for a few precious moments. Attracts the attention of multiple targets and leads them away when thrown. Oh, we can do a duck on wheels. We can do a duck on wheels that will, that we can, that we can um, lead other people away from us. That's nice. We can't do it though, we don't have black powder and we don't have a power cell. So the double plus wood, it hits harder than one rolling pin but not quite as quick. Heavy damage on impact, limited reach but can strike multiple targets per swing. Okay, so this is just two rolling pins taped together. Oh yes, that's exactly what I wanted, a tranquilizer dart, yeah. Makes someone dreadfully tired for a short while, reduces the target endurance for a short time, target can attack and pursue less. Oh, that's too... Okay, so this is not quite what I imagined, but I guess it's something, because I kind of wanted to tranquilize a dart that would, like, I don't know, knock him unconscious if you hit them. So, not, not knock him, but poison them unconscious if you hit them. But, yeah, I guess that's something. So, and we have enough of it. So we can craft a few of those. Or maybe not. For five of those... Starts, we need three rotten apples. Okay, but we got it now. So yeah, Rick the stunt duck. Hmm. So I don't really oh no, we just have the weapons. So black powder, what do we need for the salt saltpeter and charcoal? Charcoal we have, but I guess saltpeter we have to um, scavenge here. The antiseptic for the rotten rotten potatoes so it kills infections even more useful on a bandage yeah so let's craft one of those or two of those so what else can we do here there's nothing you can't fix with duct tape fixes leaks holes and mechanical problems in many circumstances okay oh and here's the water filter Millions of tiny holes let only the water through. Removes joy and impurity from water. Single usage. Hmm, so we're definitely going to need this if we want to fill our canteens here because the water spiked. So it's a metal tube. I already have... I only have one of those. So these seem to be really rare. Okay, hold gear to craft. So, and this is the disposable safe cracker. I don't remember that we ever needed one of those, or did it just come automatically? All you need now is a safe to crack. Yeah, we didn't really have a lot of safes here before, so, okay. 
yeah, we already have a proper suit. That's what we're wearing now. And um, we have seven points available now. And I know I said before that I want to do want to increase our health a bit but right now i think maybe we should start investing into stealth it only gets more and more dangerous so and maybe this one isn't too bad now this the, the smooth talkers and maybe we should start talking to people so body snatcher search and carry bodies fast don't drop bodies quietly tippy toe sprint quietly okay that's not so bad either then people will ignore your annoying habits wow Okay, that's good. That's really good. So I think we need to start investing into this now. Reduced visibility at night sounds also really nice. Then nothing to see here. Go out at night without the bobbies fussing at you. Witnesses will react more slowly to your trespassing, giving you time to run away. Attacks on unaware enemies do double damage. Okay, that's also... Mm -hmm. Throwing distraction objects, bottle stacks, etc. will cause more of a distraction. Hmm. Definitely need to invest into stealth. I mean, those aren't... Combat isn't bad either, maybe, but... No, I think we need to... I think our health needs to wait. Um, We're gonna go and increase our stealth. Oh, it just costs only three. So we have four left. That doesn't help us a lot. So that's it. And... Oh! Ah, okay, so we're not done with our quest. We need to turn off the water, too. Is there another, I don't know, diary of prudence or something? Oh, okay, it's past our curfew. Now, if I can find the switch again, I'm in business. Oh, the power switch. This one. Okay. Oh, okay, so now we have some light. Now we can search these guys. Constable Woolner. There are a lot of Constable Woolners here, are there? Because... Woolner and Bacon we already met in, in the... In the no, Rainwashing facility. Okay, so we accessed our hatch, and now I'm just gonna take a quick look around. So what's this? There's toxic waste here. I didn't realize that. So this is our new track access hatch. Ah, oh, okay. So there are, there are joy, joy booths here. There are shops as well, and we need to get here. Oh, and here's a dick spot. Is this the one where we tried to get in, where the where the bobbies were? Probably. Maybe this was the one from the park. Okay, the Church of Simon says. Hmm, this is really close by. Now we know where we have to, where we're safe. So. I'm kind of wondering what are the I what the I symbol mean? Oh, it's a point of interest. Mrs. Chippy Park, the Cozy Tea Park, Wellington Wells Constabulary. Yeah, we were there already. Break into the old government printing office. So I would propose that we're going to go here, kind of to um, check out the situation. How bad it really gets when we're out after curfew so now we should be able to sneak because it's forbidden to be outside anyway so okay okay so there are guards in the streets we need to get back there I'm just wondering how will we, oh no oops sorry how will be able how will we be able to hide out on, on the open street so I guess he's coming back he 
he doesn't see us here. Okay. I'm just gonna go for it now. Oh no, there's a balloon. Will he spot us too? Okay, he doesn't seem to spot us. Have to go through a joy detector. I oh, better no. take my joy. Oof. Okay, that's not what I wanted to do, though. Oh. Oh, okay, so sometimes they do recognize us. Hmm. There was a phone box, wasn't there? No, that's a post box. Hmm. What's that? Come on over here and unpack your tree. It's a shady dealer. Hello. So much to choose from. Okay. Hmm. Fit in among workers and raise no suspicion when fixing traps. Where to conform in construction areas or municipal facilities. Okay, so here we can buy some components and also some clothes. What's this? Crash. Flushes all the joy from your body. Why on earth would you want to do that? Zeroes out joy level. Does not reduce withdrawal or memory loss symptoms. I guess we're in a position now where we need to take joy sometimes just to pass through um, one of those uh, one of those portals. So I guess buying buying those pills is necessary now although we don't want to so i was just gonna buy both because we need to have it protect the constable's head rather less than well than it used to reduce damage oh okay we can put that on i don't want to wear the constable helmet hmm the black powder doesn't i think i'm gonna go with that as well and then the electro lock shocker is also we have enough money, so oh, let's buy it a little bit. Okay, now I'll be enough. off now. Yeah, we found a dealer. He has a funny store. Um, there's some. One of those balloons is coming. Oh, he just passed. Oh, okay, so there was a joy booth that we could use. Okay. That's like the wrong direction I'm going in now. No, it's not, it's the right. Um, yeah. What's this one doing? Oh, that's just a television. I thought this was another one of those. Oh no! Don't come around this corner. Okay. Uh, 
Okay, so now we're back in our safe house and the other way around we get some joy. Though on the other hand, I don't want to pop a joy now in the middle of the night where it just doesn't give us any more benefit than just to go over there. Maybe it's not even, maybe this mission isn't even available during the day, so I don't know. Um, yeah, but I think we're going to do this the next time. Why am I going there? I don't need to go there. Um, yeah, we're going to take a quick nap. We're going to take a quick break. We're going to take a nap. And then we will... There are a few more side quests that maybe we can find out about. We're going to sleep. And the next time we are going to take another joy while going out, then we can, I don't know, collect some few side quests and then we'll see what will happen. I kind of wanted to. I wanted to keep the, the joy consumption as little as possible, but now it kind of showed that this might be not um, possible in the extent that I wanted it to. So we probably have to take more joy than I wanted to take. But yeah, we now have the, the right medicine to, to stop the overdose risk and then we'll see some new rainbows then. <laughs> The city will be much more beautiful, but yeah, we're gonna see. So we're gonna take a quick nap now, and tomorrow we will continue further. So thank you so much for watching, um, first double-digit episode, episode 10, and I will see you next time. Thank you so much again for watching and for bearing with me, and... I will see you very soon after the quick nap.